Galaxies show us how matter is structured on a massive scale in the cosmos. Scientists investigate how matter is now arranged and how that structure has evolved across cosmic time to better comprehend the nature and history of the universe. However, JWST has already delivered significant data that scientists think will reshape astronomy. Janice Lee of the National Science Foundation's Noel Lab in Arizona leads one observational program that searches for youthful locations of star formation in galaxy. On behalf of Lee's team, JWST observed NGC 7496, a galaxy 24 million light years away, which early star forming areas had previously been covered in darkness. Hubble's instruments were unable to penetrate the heavy dust and gas that surrounded these regions. JWST, on the other hand, can see infrared light that bounces off the dust, allowing it to explore near the moments when stars turn on and nuclear fusion occurs in their cores. The dust is actually lighting up, said Lee. What's most astonishing, she says, is that NGC 7496 is a regular galaxy that suddenly springs to life and displays pathways where stars are developing under the watching eye of JWST. Meanwhile, John Barentine, an astronomer with the Arizona-based Dark Sky Conservation Organization Dark Sky Consulting, found a more accidental finding in one of JWST's first photographs. The image of the Southern Ring Nebula, which is 2,500 light years away from Earth, was exceptionally clear, a fascinating galaxy previously misinterpreted as part of the nebula itself, peaked into view when seen edge on, which is a unique vantage position for viewing the galaxy's center bulge. JWST should also be able to detect even more distant supernovas and galaxies, giving it another ability to act as a probe of the early cosmos. It may also discover stars ripped apart by supermassive black holes at galaxies centers, something no previous observatory has discovered. Friends, please let us know in the comments how you like the video. To watch all new videos on my channel, subscribe the channel and click on the bell icon. Bye.